Hi guys, we are here at Fred Hall 2017 and we're here at the OEX booth. Uh, this is Greg, he is the Western Regional Sales Rep for Jackson Kayak. And he's gonna take the time for us, he's gonna take a little bit of time with us to show us two setups. One setup is for my spearfishing buddies, my Spiro, my Spiro crowd, the Spiro Nation. We're gonna talk about a uh, nice platform for us to use as a dive platform where you can pull all your stuff inside. I'll let him cover that. And then we're also gonna talk about a kayak that's good for kayak fishing. So. Take it away. Hi guys, Greg D from Jackson Kayak here, and I have the new CUDA HD for 2017. This is an update on the awesome CUDA series from Jackson, and we've gone through and updated this boat with a lot of new features and a lot of cool special stuff. It's a little longer than the old CUDA, it's at 12 feet 10, and way more stability. So really easy to stand and cast out of, great platform, and a nice hull speed and good glide. So, real quiet bow and good entry. We also have updated hatches here on the front. So, real quick and easy access to the interior. Along with the same center hatch system that, that we've used in the old CUDA series, which makes for great, easy access to the interior of the boat. I have this drop-in tray here that I can pull out so I can store tons of gear on the inside, tackle, uh, my catch. Lots of included features here. Coming with rod holder on the side. We have a high-low tracked out seating here. So this is a trimmable adjustment trim on the seat. Our same tier one seat with pockets on the front and pockets on the side for Plano boxes here. We've got a hydration system and a Thermarest lumbar support. Coming with two ram tubes and two flush mounts. We can see we also have a J-Crate low in here to show it off for the show here at Fred Hall. And the ability to mount power pole or rig up a motor mount here. Of course, it's also rudder ready. Really nice paddling boat, 12 foot 10. Nice glide, still maneuverable for inland waters as well. Here we are with the Kraken 13.5. And this is a great boat for the salt. And a lot of the spear fishermen really like this boat for one of the reasons that it's low side walls and easy in and out of the water. So you've got a nice deck area here, lots of room to work with, and it makes hopping in and out really simple and straightforward. Also has the same center hatch system as the CUDA series. It's a little more slanted. Yeah, the nice water bottle holder on the inside. Keep that salt water off the rim of your bottle. And then easy to put your fins and gun inside. So some folks will even trim off the inside and go sans tray here to have that extra space. So, and then trimmable seat here. So depending on if you're doing surf launches and landing, it's really nice to be able to slide this seat back and keep that bow riding high both on the landing, being able to edge control this boat and keep from getting spun out on your surf landings, very key. And say you are fishing, decide you want to fish with a live well in the back, you can slide this forward and help keep the boat nice and trim in the water. Or if you're just hauling lots of stuff. Access in the stern of the boat here, and then the bow access as well. So lots of interior storage space and accessibility. Really just a great gliding boat through the water. It paddles super nice, has a ton of secondary stability, and the way the boat's so maneuverable using those outside edges makes it just a joy to paddle through the surf in heavy conditions. Yeah, so this is also a rudder ready setup here. So if you decide you want to mount a rudder, no problem. Really easy to do, just slide the cables through, pull out the screws and it's all molded and inserts. So it's a bomber attachment point. I, I fished a, a Jackson kayak and to, talk, to be completely honest with you, the only reason I got the Jackson kayak was because I wanted something that could fit my spear gun and my, and my fins in the hull. So we're not to worry about like losing them in the surf, right? But now that I've, been using the kayak for a while. Like, I, I, love I think it was, it's, it's really well thought out and uh, I, I think the, the company in general has a really cool creation story. So can you tell us a little bit about Jackson as a brand? Sure, of course. So Jackson's a, a family-run company and it started with, uh, Jackson, uh, started with Eric Jackson who's a world professional freestyle whitewater kayaker and decided to build a brand out that, around that. And 
Um, it's a really cool family-run company, and they all, what I like about working for them, as opposed to having a big, huge, giant corporation, is they always try to do the right thing. And in, in the build of their boats, you know, they try to always incorporate as much as possible U.S.-made parts. So, like on the Kraken here, the only part ma made in the USA is the GoPro mount which I think is really cool. The only part not made in the USA? That's correct. Every other part and piece on this boat, from the rivets to the screws and everything else, is US sourced oh, and built. Cool. And so they're all built with pride there in Sparta, Tennessee. Anybody who happens to be in Tennessee anytime, they do great tours at the factory. Oh, that's cool. And it's a really cool way to see how boats are built and to see the love and the, all the thought process that's that cool. goes into building each boat. Awesome. What about for us local guys? SoCal. SoCal. Your local dealers, OEX, who were here at their booth at Fred Hall. And they have locations both in, um, in Sunset Beach and then here in San Diego in Mission Bay and their SUP location in Point Loma. And then other folks not out of SoCal, they can always go to our dealer locator on our website at jacksonkayak.com and they can put in their state and they can see all their closest dealers available to them. Sweet, awesome. Cool, well, thank you. Hey, thanks so much. Appreciate the time. Thank you. Sweet.